Welcome to Wonderland Weekly, hosted by Toronto Ty. Now sit back and have a wonderful week. All right, it is that time of year again for Kids Fest here in Kidsville. And uh, quite a few changes from what I can see. Uh, really, really great changes, honestly. Um, they moved all the uh, all those posts that they've been using for all the other festivals. They moved those in here. I don't believe those were here last year. They also added these signs onto the post. Once again, I don't remember these last year, but I wasn't paying as much attention last year, I think. Um, so correct me if I'm wrong, but I feel like those are new and they're really, really nice. Uh, all sorts of different character meet and greets. Of course, you gotta have the Marvel characters, right? You got Black Panther, Spider-Man, Iron Man, Captain America, Star-Lord, and Ant-Man. Uh, all on different days. Uh, so depending on what day you come, then you get to see different ones. Of course, you got the classic Silent Disto and the Foam Pit. Uh, you've got the Ninja Turtles showing up, uh, which is really great. They are classic characters. all that. Um, I love, you know, that they do so much for Kids Fest. Uh, you got Thomas the Tank Engine, Bob the Builder, Toopy and Binu. I don't even know who they are really, but whatever. Uh, Alvin and the Chipmunks. Uh, I don't like the new design for them, but you know, whatever. Um, and then you've got uh, Doodoo the Clown, who is of course classic, and unfortunately I did miss because he was only here basically while I was on vacation. Uh, and then you have Aaron Matthews the Magician. Different from our uh, traditional Spencer the Magician. Um, so, I'm not sure if he's performing today. Let's see. Uh, yeah, he should be performing today. Oh, I think I missed him. Oh, well. Anyway, checking out the rest of the stuff here. As I said, these uh, posts here are really, really great with the spring lights, although the spring lights do not show up at all when it's this bright out. Uh, they moved over to Cornhole Games. Uh, they moved over the stage. Where they have, uh, you know, several different performances as well as the silent disco. Um, they've got, well, they've got. Um, yeah, let's show this off. They got the hop scotch here. Really great. Clearly, kids are, are uh, having fun with it. Uh, they brought the Jenga over. This seems a little dangerous. <laughs> it's that. Um, with how tall the blocks are and with how tall the crate here is. Um, then you've got, uh, you know, all these, uh, I don't even know what to call these things. But anyway, they're all around a bunch of the fences around here. So, really, really cool to see that. Over here, Spider-Man. Spider-Man is honestly one of the, uh, uh, I think one of people's favorite superheroes at this point. Oh, and he's got the classic pose going on. That's great. Um, yeah, so you get to hang out with Spider-Man and all the other characters here in Kids Fast. One, uh, there are a few weird things, though. I'm not gonna lie, there are a few weird things. For one, uh, they set up these temporary games, which are not too bad. I think that makes sense. Um, but uh, then you've got Peanuts stuff here. And it's really strange because Kids Fest is very clearly only in Kidsville. And yet you're throwing in all this, like all these Peanuts character stuff. I and mean, I love these things, I really do. But it just, it seems kind of weird that they're here for, for Kids Fest when uh, there's not really, I don't know, much of a connection there. It's my favorite Ninja Turtle, Michelangelo. You can tell because one, he has the orange headband, and two, he's got his uh, nunchucks. Really, really cool. Uh, I actually love the fact that they have the uh, Ninja Turtles here. The fact that the Ninja Turtles have survived as long as they have is, honestly, it's incredible. Toopity, boopity, zoopity, zatch! <laughs> Now bring back our patchy patch! Check 
your pockets. <laughs> Another one of these uh, peanuts, you know, put your face in and you're one of the characters things. Uh, again, it's a really cool thing, but <laughs> it seems so weird when they're like very specifically not including uh, Planet Snoopy as part of this. Uh, but again, I really love these streamers here with the string lights uh, and everything on these posts. Uh, yeah, just kind of makes this area feel a little bit, I don't know, cozier? A little crowded though. Um, but uh, yeah, lots going on. So new this year is a bunch of Hasbro merchandise uh, doing some uh, placements here. I think they call them like activations or whatever. Uh, so you got Beyblade over here, which is honestly it's it's pretty great because you know the kids get to have fun with these little things. Oh, and you got Big Ben. Big Ben's always great. Um, I love Big Ben. Um, then you've got uh, you know even more stuff over here with the Nerf stuff going on. Uh, Nerf, Nerf stuff is like the best. Honestly, that's like my whole childhood. Uh, <laughs> I wish I didn't have enough for it, but really, really you cool get stuff. A slice of pizza um, for us? And yeah, so you get to shoot at right different targets. It looks like fun times. I don't know. I don't think that you get to win any prizes or anything, but it's still fun to like see that they got all this. Uh, oh man, all these things going on. So yeah, really, really cool. Really great use of the space, honestly. And uh, yeah, another post, which is very awkwardly just in the middle of the concrete here. And then the foam pit, where kids are having all sorts of clean fun, as they say. Uh, <laughs> obviously not really clean, but uh, yeah, we walk out having fun. So that's all that really matters. Really great. <laughs> Great little event here. Um, but uh, yeah, that's about it for Kids Fest, I think. But uh, yeah, really great event, and it goes on for two weeks this year. Uh, obviously, I'm here on like one of the last days, but uh, uh, I, I, I do like this festival. I like checking it out. Uh, I just think that, uh, you know, there are a few things that are still a little bit odd. Other than that, really, really great. Another couple of great uh, little photo op things here. Uh, you know, I kind of wish that they just had these set up like all the time. They're, they're really great. Not here in Planet Snoopy, unless this becomes Camp Snoopy, which is uh, a whole other discussion. But uh, yeah, you know, they're, they're, they're great little touches. And you know how much I love those little details. So the festivities, which I'm realizing now, only now, is a portmanteau of uh, festival activities. Um, they are pretty localized to like the one section of Kidsville, whereas this pathway, on the entrance pathway uh, from Planet Snoopy, not as much going on, but they do still have these signposts up here to let you know that Kids Fest is going on. And uh, clearly, very, very popular event. Uh, really, really great to, uh, you know, to see Wonderland being able to do something to uh, make sure that families come during one particular time. Uh, as I'm sure most of you know, uh, families is where Wonderland really makes money. It's not so much from us thrill seekers. So great to see, uh, you know, that they're able to do so much in order to uh, get people uh, get people to come here. And it's clearly working. It's clearly, you know, a very well-run event with uh, lots of stuff, lots of different stuff in the day. Uh, yeah, I I feel like this event could be expanded even more for next year. Uh, you know, taking like uh, just being over a longer period and um, yeah, just uh, maybe filling in a little bit of this part if they feel like they have enough space, which I'm not sure if they do or not. But uh, other than that, I'll all about do it here in Kidsville. And now I'm gonna walk through your planet soupy quickly to. Uh, get out of the uh, kids bar <gasps> thanks so much for watching be sure to like the video comment with anything you'd like me to cover in the future subscribe hit the notification bell and support me on patreon so that i can visit more parks and create more wonderful videos